Hey, I'm Traveling John, and I'm going to travel and sketch. Join me on the adventure. Starting off in Auburn, we traveled through the Central Valley and Sacramento to Napa and Sonoma area, then heading north up through Santa Rosa and some beautiful agricultural areas before we went over the coastal range of mountains winding back and forth to Mendocino. We are enjoying one of the beautiful areas of California. This is Mendocino behind me. It's a small art town on the coast, uh, Pacific Coast, above San Francisco. Now, San Francisco is a very populated area, along with Santa Rosa and some of the other areas in Northern Bay Area. But there aren't as many people coming to this area uh, as tourists as others. But enough tourists come to this area to support a thriving art community. So there's a lot of artists up here from painting to ceramics to furniture. You can see all sorts of wonderful items of art here. And there's wonderful restaurants, wonderful hotels and motels, excuse me, um, bed and breakfast is more appropriate in this area. We are staying tonight at a wonderful bed and breakfast uh, down the coast from here. And you'll see beautiful Victorian homes that have been built like a hundred years ago, going along Highway 1, which comes to Mendocino. Uh, so it's a beautiful, arty area just in the traveling. From, we left the Santa Rosa area and we came up, we went through vineyards, we went through Redwood Forest, we went through all those beautiful, beautiful areas, the landscapes in California and just absolutely loved it. In fact, when I was a child, we stayed, oh, I would say about 20 minutes away from Mendocino and uh, a Redwood area park called Paul M. Dimmick. It's a state park. And the beautiful thing about that as a child for me is that they lumbered it. I know that's a bad thing to say, but they lumbered it, the redwood trees, oh, I would say 150 years ago at about 10 feet tall. So they chopped them off at that height. And what was left was these stumps. And the stumps are huge round stumps. And in this state park, the children love, including me, of course, at the time, love to climb up them and make a little forts in each different stump in that redwood forest. So here I'm advertising for Paul M. Dimmick Park at the same time. This is a place that's always inspired me. And what I'm going to do is decide on a sketch, of course, of that someplace in Mendocino to do, and maybe even in the outskirts here. In fact, there's so much to illustrate and so much to be inspired by. And I would encourage you to come. And you know, the best season to visit this area is either in the fall, which is right now, we're in the end of September, or the spring, because you don't have quite as much fog. It's so crystal clear and beautifully cool. So I hope you have a chance to visit Mendocino, the art, the beautiful scenery, and I'll step out of the way so you can get a little panoramic view of this area.
Welcome to my first travel and sketch vlog for 2022. With the start of this year, I am going to be changing the format of the vlog, hoping that it is an improvement. Before, I did a black and white sketch vlog, and then after that, I did a color sketch or color adaptation of that black and white sketch. And there were two different pieces of artwork and I explained or I went through the process in two different vlogs. Now I'm going to be combining them into one vlog. And that way you'll see the transition a little bit better going from the black and the white to the color. There will be less talking on this vlog explaining what I'm doing. And if I do want to get across something very important, I will include it in a text to the side of my artwork. So you can see that process. With regard to Mendocino, one very important uh, building feature of that town are the many old water towers. So that's something I featured in the sketch. In fact, what I'd like to do is share this one little vignette video I took. You can see the young man and the water tower. Those are two elements that I took off on with regard to this sketch. Now I call this sketch Mendocino Dream, and that is because what I did is I took different features of that town that are really enjoyed. First of all, of course, is the beautiful Pacific Ocean that surrounds that town on the peninsula. And the other thing is the redwood forest in the distance and the water towers. We were there in the fall, so there were the pumpkins here and there. And I took all those elements, and of course the Victorian homes, which are gorgeous. And I tried to include, include as many of that as that as I could into this artwork. So here we go into the process of creating that artwork. I hope you enjoy that process and I will join you again after you see this video.
so that's the end of my presentation on creating the black and white artwork and the color artwork. I hope you enjoyed that. If you would like to see the finished pieces of artwork framed, I would encourage you to go to my website, which is travelandsketch.com. And there you'll see a button that says Fine Art Gallery. It's on the right hand side. And that will take you to Fine Art America and my portion of that website and gallery where you'll see not only the work I just finished, but many other pieces of art that I've done on other travel and sketch vlogs and even before that. So before I leave you, I would encourage you to also subscribe to this channel. And that way you'll be not notified on the next time I have a travel and sketch adventure. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.